Hey weirdos, welcome to another edition of the Road Trip Ruminations, brought to you by Spreaker from my heart. Well, here I am, headed towards Plattsburgh, New York. Uh, I'm in the state of New York last night, I stayed just outside of Buffalo, and on my way, I, got, I have another four hours or so that I still need to make my way, uh, make my way there, and I started seeing a sign on the side of the road that just confused the heck out of me. Now, you're used to being on highways and seeing rest areas. You ever seen a text area? It looks exactly like a rest area sign, but it says, text stop. And, and I'm not kidding you. These are rest areas specifically for you to stop and play on your phone. <laughs> Welcome to New York. Oh my gosh. I mean, it is a rest area anyway. I mean, you can stop and you can use the restroom and everything else. But the whole idea that they have a sign that says you can stop and text. They even had a sign a few miles back saying it can wait. Text stop coming in five miles. So it's, it's just a reminder. You don't have to text on your phone. You can wait until you get to this next rest area to text. But the whole concept of having a sign to point that out is just ludicrous. I, I had to take a photo of it, and unfortunately, and the ironic part is, the cell signal here at the text stop sucks. So I can't <laughs> upload photos uh, or anything uh, to take advantage of the text stop. So, uh, uh, okay, well, uh, New York. Uh, New York, I mean, you're beautiful, but you're insane. So, <laughs> but once I get to somewhere, I'll, I'll upload the photo. So, uh, so you'll know that I'm not lying about this. There actually is something called a text stop now in New York. Uh, so th these are the kind of things that I'll be, I'll be uploading. And I mean, just these little thoughts that I come, that I find or come up with, uh, funny ideas that I have, or just something that I want to comment on. That's what the roadside ruminations are going to be all about. Something else that I was thinking of earlier with the latest uh, release of the Halloween franchise, the movies, uh, Halloween Ends, and for those of you who've seen the end of it, you know what happens. I'm wondering if they continue it, because you know that's not going to be the end. Even though they say Halloween Ends, it, it makes too much money for the franchise to just completely stop. Somebody's going to try to either reboot it or find some way of bringing Michael back or whatever. Now, how do you bring Michael back? I, here, here is my concept. The next, the next sequel in the Halloween franchise will be, will be uh, titled Halloween Creeps. And it'll actually act as a reboot of The Blob. There you go. And if you've seen Halloween, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So that, it'll be a Halloween sequel slash reboot of The Blob. You can see you can do both at the same time. It works perfectly fine. All right, anyway, hope you guys are having a great day. Head, headed to Plattsburgh, New York for the Dark Waters Paranormal Conference. And if you want to uh, you want to see me there, I'm going to be there Friday night, all day Saturday, and then the early part of Sunday from uh, 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. on Sunday. So three full days, well, not full days, but three days of uh, a lot of fun with the Paranormal Expo and the conferences and, and everything else. They've got a, a metal show taking place, I think, Friday night. Um, they've got, uh, anyway, you, you could check it out and see everything that's happening, but they got a lot of stuff happening in the, in the evening hours as well. Uh, each, each evening after they close at like six or seven or 8 PM, which, whichever, whatever night it is, whatever time they're closing that night, the vendors, you can keep on partying with everybody. Uh, excuse me. You can keep on partying with people as they head out to all these other things. So you can check it out on the road trip page at WeirdDarkness.com. That's WeirdDarkness.com slash road trip. And if you're liking these uh, road trip ruminations, let me know. I'd appreciate it.